Hello guys, welcome to another video. So today's topic is AR that is augmented reality. So what is augmented reality? Actually, it's a technology that superimposes a computer generator or you can say a virtual image on a user's view of the real world and thus providing a composite view. Like many of us use Snapchat, so most of the filters such as that of cat, dog, all of these, they are made using AR. One of the best examples of AR is Pokemon Go. There you can see Pokemons in real world. Now, what I'm going to do is that I'll place a virtual city which I have designed on a drawing sheet on which I have drawn the design of the city. Means, I'm just going to place a 3D model over a 2D design. So, first of all, what you have to do is, you will just have to open the new project in Unity, which I have already opened. Now, here, you have to import the Vuforia package. So for that, you can just go to Assets and then Import Package, Custom Package and then you can import the Vuforia package. After that, what you have to do is, in the left window, right click and go to Vuforia Engine and then click on AR Camera. So. In Vuforia engine, there is air camera. You can open this. I have already opened all of them. So then you have to go to the website of this Vuforia developer portal, which is this. Now in this, what you have to do is you have to log in your details. Just log in. This. Okay, so I have logged in. Now you have to go to the develop option. Right, so here is the develop option. Now you have to get a license key. So just go to dev get developer key. And then you just have to write the name of the license. And then you have to confirm and then you will get a license key. So you will just have to paste that license key to here. We'll go to air camera and then to open Vuforia engine configuration and here's the license key. So you just have to paste it here. After that we have to do is go to target manager and then you have to add the database from here and you have to add the image target. Like I have already added this database, this is my city and here I have added the target image which is this this is the target image you can use this also to see that these are the points which it will detect in the picture so so here you, you just have to add a target image then you have to select this image and you have to download all the databases and then after downloading this you have to save it and then import in your project now after this what you have to do is open unity you have to go to asset store and or the package manager here you can see all the assets you can use so what you have to do is from asset store you have to import all the 3d mo models or 2d texture or other things which you require so here i've already added many things like you, you can see so like you can see houses trees bushes cars dustbins street lights traffic lights buildings petrol pump park and many other things so as per your requirements you can import whatever you want and one main thing what you have to do is that you have to push each element in the image target so this is really important so i have already added these i have also adjusted the position of each element now if you want to download this application in your phone then for that you just have to go to file and then build settings now here you have to choose one of these i'm choosing android 
and then you have to click on switch platform after that i have already clicked so this is my screen after this you can go to the player settings and here uh, you can change anything if you want and then after that you just have to build and then save your project with an extension of .apk so this is what you have to do here now let's just run this app on phone